Sexy Walden people from YouTube. How you guys doing? I hope you guys having a good day. Hope you guys having a safe day if you're working, um, making that cheddar. All right. Today's video, guys, we're gonna do the 5G. All right. What does that mean? 5G is a set position. So pipe is gonna. It's not gonna move once you tack it. You're gonna put it in position any height you want, but you know, not the pipe is not gonna move. All right. For from where you put it, all right? So, we're gonna use a six inch pipe. This is a Schedule 40 pipe, all right? So, we're gonna clean this pipe real good. Do a nickel landing on it, you know, bevel it. We are gonna use 6010, 18 from the root. Probably gonna do 6010 hot pass, and then we'll probably cap it with 8010, all right? So, without further ado, guys, let's get it done. All right, guys, you guys saw that one side is bigger than the other one. So we're just going to whip it, whatever we need to do, push it and drag it, whatever you had to do just to make that root go in, all right? Alright guys, for the hot pads we're just going to use 1A6-10 uh, with a third gear 30, just the same as the root, you know, I didn't have a, somebody to mess up with the remote, probably a good idea if you can get somebody to help you, um, I had to stop every time, you know, I was either too hot or too cold, you know, I had to stop and readjust the temperature manually, but, um, you know, I'm gonna try to find somebody because it's you know if you have somebody playing with the remote is it's good and very helpful so like I said 1-8 third gear and start at 30 you know go up and down depending on how you see the puddle um, run for the half pass and then after that we're gonna probably use a fill too all right <laughs>
right guys for the cap we're gonna use 532nd 8010 um, I started a third gear at 55 but uh I changed it to four gear and and 40 and that actually helped me I think it runs better for me uh, right now um, so four gear and 40 all right that's what I started and then you know up and down from there stop and re readjust um, the R4 so on my machine is uh, 10 I didn't move it from there because from the root and and 60 10 80 10 rods I usually good to have the R4 all the way up at least that's what I heard and at school and what people told me so that's what I live it at but for cap when you're doing your cap also a welder told me you know four gear and you want to have the amperage bigger than the voltage or something like that so what that means is that the four gear you know and a 40 instead of third gear and 50 or 65 so that's what I tried today um, 5 30 second 80 10 4 gear and 40 guys it actually worked pretty good for me um, so you know that's what practice is all about you know play with the settings of the machine learn what worked best for you and keep welding And sexy welding people from YouTube, that was it for today, guys. Like I said, this is practice for me. You know, like you guys know, we just got my machine um, this year, so practicing, you know. As you can see here, I'm gonna show you, I did uh, like six more caps, because, you know, definitely can improve on the cap part. As you can see here, we did like six more caps, some look better than the other ones, you know, messing up with the heat and the position of the rod. So just keep practicing, guys, all right? Like I said in my last video, probably not the best cap, not the worst. Like I said, we're learning together, practicing. I hope you guys have a Merry Christmas and a, and Happy New Year. Hopefully, you know, we keep practicing and keep getting better and better. Um, we need a lot to improve especially the cap part, but that's what um, practicing, you know, the more you practice, the better you're gonna get. All right, so Captain Man is gonna keep practicing, guys. Um, stay tuned for the 6G. Be safe out there, and I'll see you next time, all right? Adios.